Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Is that our fish? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, yeah, yeah. You got Kelton, keep going. Keep going. All right, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. We're about to head on out to the beach, do a little bit of fishing with Kelton and with Beach Bum. But before we head on out there, I want to talk to you all real quick. I know a lot of y'all have already applied for a job at the tackle store, but we're gonna be doing a job fair or career fair at the tackle store. I believe it's March 21st. I'm gonna have a link down below where you can go sign up if you are interested in working with us. You can come on out to that job fair. We're gonna do like some group interviews and different stuff like that. If you have already applied, you should have gotten an email from us about how to register for that job fair. But if you, all, if you have not done that and you are interested in doing so, Make sure you go check out the link down below. I'm also gonna have everything I'm using in this video link down below. There's like some truck out there picking up a bunch of crap or something. It's like super loud. Hopefully y'all can hear me all right, but if you're interested in working with us, again, link down below. We'd love to see y'all out there at the job fair. We, we got the old home gym back here. We've actually been working out a little bit. Been riding the Peloton as well. If you also have a Peloton, go follow me on there. Just search Bearded Brad, should be able to find me. But I've uh, been, been trying to work out and get a little healthier. I've already lost like 13 pounds. Feeling good. But we're going to go ahead and head on out to the beach. Do a little bit of fishing. I'll catch y'all when we get out there. We're out on the beach with Mr. Beach Bum himself yeah. today. And uh, he's basically going to take me on a little guided fishing trip. It, it takes me back. <laughs> Kelton is actually now homeschooled. So he's out here with us today. He wanted to catch some pompano. So who better to call than the Beach Bum? This counts as class, right? I mean, yeah. You're going to learn yeah. a lot more out here than a lot of, <laughs> lot of Absolutely. subjects at school. Absolutely. But we got some pretty good conditions today. We got a southeast wind, some pretty clean water. And uh, what's the wa water temps? I think are like 70. I haven't looked. Like we, 69, we're, 70. We're there. Pompano. It's time. Which is crazy because what's today? March 9th. Yes. What? I got to make my car payment. Yeah. Dang it. <laughs> <laughs> Looking at the calendar sucks. <laughs> but uh, we, we got a few different baits. We got shrimp. I got ghost shrimp. And we're going to try to get some sand fleas and hopefully get on some pompano. That is the goal. Also, about this time of year is when we should be catching some redfish off the beaches, too. Always got a shot right now. So hoping we can maybe find a redfish. We'll see what all we're going to get into. But uh, Kelton's about to go for a swim, I guess. But <laughs> we're going to get everything rigged up. I'm going to show you what we got working with today. Let's get to fishing. All right, guys. First setup here, we got a ghost shrimp. And I just took the float off of this rig, so we got just an empty hook and a ghost shrimp. I got nothing on the bottom drop. I'm just gonna do one ghost shrimp on the top. We're kind of fishing a little point here, so I'm gonna have to try to wade out just a hair to get on the back side here. Try not to get completely soaked. Look, Daddy, I found a clam. Oh, nice. Next setup, we got Salty's Pompano Rigs. This is the Bama Beach Bum Edition, purple and white. And Matt already found a sand flea. This is one of the male sand fleas. They look super crazy. We got that on here. And then just a piece of fresh dead shrimp. You gonna get us some sand fleas? What? You getting us some sand fleas? No, oh, don't lose them. Good job, Kelton. You know, Matt, if it wasn't for the long hair, I wouldn't be able to tell you all apart. <laughs> yeah. Nice. There you go. Good job. Oh, there you go. Going? Yeah, yeah. Going. Matt's run. Oh, are you there? Yep, there he is. He's on here. Hey. He's jumping. He's jumping. Yeah. What do you have out here? Sand flea? Sand flea, yeah. A little piece of fish gum, on the sand flea. Nice. He's not really fighting now. He's just coming in. Swimming sideways. Let's see if we got us a pompano this morning. On the old ninja dagger. Exactly. There he is. There he is. Yep. What do you think, Calton? What's it going to be? Pompano. Pompano. It is a pompano. Yay. Nice. Hey. Yeah. That's a good one, man. First fish of the morning. And uh, it's, all, it's all on the bearded Brad float. Heck yeah. We stole Beach Bone's setup here. We got a nice pompano. Good keeper to start the day. Daddy, I even got it right. You wanna hold him? Look, he, that one's thick. He is fat. That's nice, man. It's gonna be a good eater size, Kelton. What do you think? I'm gonna take a picture. Okay, let's go back this way. Show the camera. 
All right, first pompano of the day on the sand flea and fish gum. What do you think, Kelton? You excited? You gonna catch the next one? All right, we're gonna go throw this guy on ice, get some baits back out. Here, you keep it, you keep it. <laughs> All right, let's go. Getting your workout in, trying to get these sand fleas. So are we going to carry sand fleas at the store and you're going to be the one to go out and catch them for us? Uh, negative. <laughs> yeah, if the problem is like when they show up where you can see them and get them easy, is when you don't need them. Right. It's like when they're not biting. They're coming through. It's got the tank. Here you go. Here you go. Get the tank. There you go. Get him, Calton. You got it. Get him. Heck yeah. We got the school coming through. A five-year-old working an 11 foot surf rod. Don't yank him too much, Calton. Just keep it nice and steady. You're doing good, buddy. That's a giant fishing pole for a little boy. It works for me. <laughs> yeah. I mean, Kelton might be taller than you here in just a couple years. <laughs> oh, there he is, Kelton. You see him? You see him? Yeah. All right, keep reeling. Keep reeling. Good job. All right, here he comes. Keep reeling, buddy. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Nice. You got him. Nice, dude. Oh, That's another Pompano. Oh, it's Pompano. Ah. 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 We don't lay them on the ground. At least, at least we have tackle for <laughs> Right. <laughs> Look at that one. What do you think? Oh. Now you can take a picture with two pompano. All right, let's go put them on the cooler. Good job, Kelton. <laughs> nice work, Kelton. Heck yeah, we're gonna be eating a good lunch today. You having fun? All right. Oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Is that our fish? Is that our fish? The Osprey's trying to take Kelton's fish. Go, 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 go. <laughs> that was insane. Are you trying to get the fish? I saw the splash and I was like, dang, Kelton's got a giant. And then I saw the bird and I was like, the Osprey's trying to take it. I don't know, I don't know if the fish stayed on or not. Just keep, just keep rolling, just keep going, yeah, keep rolling. I don't, I don't know if it's there or not, just keep breathing in. Man, that was crazy, dude. <laughs> I've never seen that before. He might have lost our fish for us. That osprey tried to steal Kelton's fish. He's coming back for more. Yeah, keep reeling, buddy. Uh oh, uh oh. Oh yeah, yeah. You got Kelton, keep going, keep going. The bird is trying to take our fish. No, 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 no. Oh, okay. Oh, that poor fish, man. <laughs> He's like, I got a bird coming after me. I got a hook ripping me. Good job, Kelton. That's what I was going to look and see. The bait is still on. Maybe? Ma maybe. Yeah, he might have. Yeah, it might looks like the Osprey tried to get him right there. Oh, oh, oh right there. There it is. Dude, that is Check crazy. that out. Look, that's where that bird tried to take your fish. I've never seen an Osprey try to take a fish that you were like physically catching. It's happened a couple of times yeah. to me, yeah. But, and, and they do love popping it. Yeah. They freaking love popping That was wild. Yeah. Where'd he go? There he is right there. Uh, he's, he's still eyeballing it, dude. This one is a little small, so we are going to let him go. Put him back. Yeah, we got to put him back. He's too small to keep. We got to put him back. Kelton. Hey, he's too small. That Osprey is still looking for him. What's up, guys? We're cooking some Papano. My dad is weird. <laughs> You're crazy. We caught three fish, dude. <laughs> You're weird. You're weird. All right, guys, we are back at the house now. Kelton, hey. did you have fun fishing? Yes. What's your favorite part? Fishing. How many fish do you catch? How many fish did I catch? One, one, one. One, 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 come. One, one, one. Who won? Who won the one v one? You did. As always, Kelton wins again. Do you remember what you caught? Pumpkin. 
Pompano. We only caught Pompano. You ready to cook them? We just caught Pompano. Yep. You ready to cook them? So we got three Pompanos. I know. Are you ready to cook them? Yes, sir. 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 All right, y'all comment down below if you want some of his energy. We'll send some over to you. But we're gonna fry some pompano. I haven't fried pompano in a while. We're gonna toss this over into we're gonna toss a this over. We're gonna use some Louisiana crispy fish fry. Put it in the bag and shake it all around. Kelton, you think you can shake it? Yeah. I will shake it too much. Do you remember when Freddie shook it too much and spilled it all over the house? Yeah. Can I shake it? Shake it like a salt shaker. We got some oil heating out back here. Try to get it to 350. Pretty never. We're at 225, so we need a little bit more time. Everything we were using today, I'm gonna have it linked down below in the description. If there's anything you want to pick up, either the rods, the reels, the sand spikes, fish gum, salties, pompadour rigs, whatever it may be, all the stuff is on the website linked down below. I'll have everything I was using. You just go check it out and we have pretty much everything on the website. So even if it was something I wasn't using that you do want to try to pick up no matter what it is, check out the site. Just scroll through there. We got a bunch of stuff. So head on over there, beachbumoutdoors.com. All right, guys, the oil's heated up. If you don't have a thermometer, an easy way to do it is just get a little bit of water on your hand. Not a lot. You don't want to put much water in there. And just flick a little bit of water. If it starts popping, you know it's starting to heat up pretty good. Definitely don't do a lot though, because water and oil don't mix. It wouldn't be good if you put a lot of water in there. That was magical. Magical? Yeah. It just popped. Let's toss some of this fish down in here. Wait, I want to do it. I want to do it. No, because it's really hot. I don't want the oil to splash you. Mm mm mm. Nothing better than some fried fish. Papa no rigs, Papa no rigs. It's raining, Papa no rigs. It's raining, Papa no rigs. <laughs> yeah. It's That's raining crazy. Tennessee players because always Tennessee wins. Yep, Tennessee plays in an hour and a half. Mm -hmm. We got the uh, SEC basketball championship going on right now. We got Tennessee, Missouri at 2.30. It's an hour and a half away. Hopefully they can move on. Alabama and I think Mississippi State are playing right now. I think Alabama was up, I don't know. Obviously by the time you see this, you're gonna know what happened. But we're gonna give this a few minutes, let it cook. We'll catch you back when it's time to eat. You ready to eat? Yeah! You got a hungry belly? All right, even though you already ate a Lunchable? Yeah. Or two Lunchables? Yeah. <laughs> Growing boy. Good. All right, the fish is done. Check it out, looks delicious. <clears throat> We got us another little helper here now. Still a little early for uh, for her to eat some fish. Can't have that quite yet. You put more ranch? Yeah. Got to have ranch with everything. All right, that, that's plenty. All right, Kelton, you take the first bite. But is it hot? No, it's cooled off now. Um, I'll try this one. Um. Going in with the ranch. Delicious. A little bit of honey mustard. Mmm. I love it. It is hard to beat some pompano. I know a lot of people don't fry pompano. They usually bake it. A lot of people cook it whole, which I still have never done. I'm not crazy about picking meat off the bones and stuff like that, so I always fillet it. Um, that, but it is very, very good fried. I did but a So is everything else. I did a little bit because I did it. Wait, have I tried this? Yeah. Ooh. Pop it on. Pop it out. We need some fish. And another helper. What do you think, Cohen? Oh my god, I just don't think you need those. Oh, bless you. Oh, cool. Wait, I'm gonna take this off so we can talk. Come on! You want more? Yeah, you want more. More? Is it good? You want the whole thing? You like fish, huh? I think Cohen will eat anything. Little bites. It's your favorite? Yeah. Daddy, I like the tuna too. The tuna is really good. I like tuna better than this. 
Tuna was my first fish that I ever ate. I don't know if it was the first one. Probably whiting. You used whiting. to have whiting when you were a baby. Like Cohen's size. Oh yeah, whiting when was my... When we first moved here, Daddy was catching it. First try fish. try some on camera? Y'all comment below if you want to see Courtney get on camera sometime. She's a little camera shy. Maybe she'll be in the next one. All right guys, we're gonna finish eating some lunch. It is good to finally see Pompano starting to show back up. So if you're coming down on vacation, pick up some Pompano rigs, some fish gum, and uh, go get yourself a meal. Kelton, you had fun? Yes. You like the Pompano? Yes. Is it delicious? Yes. We're gonna go again? It's too good. Too good? We're gonna go back out fishing on the beach again? Yes. All right. The tuna is better than all the fish. The tuna. We might have to go tuna fishing again soon. Make sure y'all go check out the website, beachbellmoutdoors.com. Everything linked down below in the description. Yay. Appreciate it. And until next time. Y'all take care.